Hey what's up, it's Chris from Rooker Films and in today's video I'm going to show you this really easy sliding video transition that you can do right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. So once you've got Premiere Pro loaded and you have two videos on your timeline, we can begin with this effect. So we have our first video clip of the camera pulling up to reveal this building and then the second video clip is shot at night and it's just a simple panning shot looking up to a few buildings. So we're going to transition from this daylight shot to the nighttime shot. So we'll pull the daylight shot, that's clip one, up to video layer two. And we'll have the nighttime shot, that's clip two, on video layer one. Now you don't want these directly on top of each other. You want the end of the video on track two to overlap the start of the video on track one. Now once these are overlapping, we can begin animating this transition. Now to animate this transition, we need to begin by creating some keyframes. So on the upper video, on the top video, we're going to create a brand new keyframe for position. Scroll across maybe 10 keyframes. And then we're going to pull the position all the way over to the left. So we want to completely wipe this video just off screen. And then at the same point of the second keyframe, we want to go down to the lower video track and create a brand new keyframe on the position. And then we'll go back the same amount of keyframes as the upper level minus one keyframe. So if you went over 10 keyframes on the top track, you want to go back on yourself nine keyframes on the lower track. Now we'll pull the position of the lower video track all the way to the right completely off screen. And then as soon as you've done that, you can pull the cursor head back one more keyframe in time and pull that keyframe that you just created over to the left. So this means there should be two keyframes on the upper and two keyframes on the lower. And the duration between both of these keyframes should be 10 keyframes on both videos. Now, if we play this back, we have this really awesome sliding transition. But if this is a little bit too fast, then all you have to do is extend the gap between the keyframes on each video. Just make sure you keep the distance between the keyframes identical between each different video layer. So if there's a 20 keyframe gap on the top video layer, make sure there is a 20 keyframe gap on the lower video layer. And there you go, it's really quick, it's really easy, and that is how you do the sliding video transition inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. And there you go. If you enjoyed watching this video, then please do let me know in that comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe and check out the previous video if you want to see more. Thank you for watching, and I will see you on the next episode.